it down, bring it down. Oh, it's a mech battle! My money's on the dreadnought. Hello everyone, Blazard here. Welcome back to some more Dawn of War 2, playing through the entire campaign. So in the last episode, if you guys missed it, there will be a little pop-up in the top right screen. I highly recommend you guys go check it out. So we finally finished up this planet. We're no longer have anything we can do here on Calderas. Now we're going to make our way over to Typhon Primus. All right, let's do it. And see what kind of chaos mayhem we can get ourselves into over there. <laughs> All right, remember, if you guys are enjoying the series, smash and destroy that like button. Leave a comment down below and subscribe to the channel. Let me know you guys are enjoying this. All right, uh, so we have two targets to do here. So we have Defend the Shrine, which is an optional mission. And then we have uh, this one right here, which is a primary target. Uh, we're going to take a look at both of them. This is obviously a defensive mission, but I want to take a look at this real quick to see what they have. Commander. We have finally located the orc who knows the location of the Astronomic Array. This orc is a mad alien who has been fused into one of their obscene war machines. This greenskin calls himself Ripper Splitter and is obsessed with technology. Destroy this alien walker and recover the location of the Astronomic Array. This is our only hope of finding a critical weakness in the Hive Fleet, Commander. Okay. Um... I think I'm going to do this one. Yeah, we're going to do this one, and then when we're done, we'll do the defense mission over here. Uh, but I think we could do this one. We're going to have to change out our loadout, <laughs> definitely. Uh, we're going to have to go with anti-armor, which we do have on right now. Uh, let's see here. What do you guys, you guys have plasma guns, so you should do a fair bit of damage. Uh, that one is actually weaker. Hmm. No, I don't want to use that. Um, I might keep that. I might give it to somebody else. But right now, no. Um, I know at some point you can give these guys... Right? Can you give these? No, scouts can't get plasma. That would be so overpowered if they could. Uh, let's take a look at the dreadnought. Uh, the dreadnought... Mm, I mean, with what we have right now... We should have sufficient firepower to take down an orc mech. All right, you know what? Let's do it. You know, we're going to go here, and then the next mission we'll go and take up this, and then we'll probably head on to where the leading uh, communication array is. All right, let's do it. And uh, reward is we get reinforce, reinforce all nearby squad. Ooh. I like that. You can get a drop pod beacon. That'd be nice, especially when you're fighting a boss. All right, let's do this. Oh, this looks like it's going to be fun. All right. So the campaign has been going on for 20 days, or I should say this battle for this sector has been going on for 20 days. Insane. Okay, then. Um, Okay. God, that did not look good. <laughs> right into the crater. Perfectly. Ooh, crap. Uh, Tactical squad, throw a grenade in here. We gotta be careful with our dreadnought. Drop some artillery right there. over here uh, they are gonna be teleporting more and more guys in aren't they back up back up let them up All right, fall back capture this objective Light him up, guys. Light him up. We got this. All 
Oh, he just threw the tank off the cliff. Nice. Oh, that was so good. Let him up, 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 let him up. More corpses. All right. I mean, are we going to catch a bit of a break? Probably not. All right. So it doesn't look like we're going to get a fallback. So this is going to be our fallback. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be our fallback. Okay, let's push it up. Oh, crap. Get up here. Get up here. Put a turret down here. We're gonna put another one down here so we can cover our backside. All right, let's move up. Move up. Take out these teleporters. Oh no, the poor dreadnought. All right, get over here and give him some cover. Yee, I didn't think he would go that way. Just try and keep him away. Press. We are really not getting out of here, are we? down there's so many orcs there's just so many freaking orcs all right we're gonna have to just push through and say forget it you're gonna stay here and cover our backside the rest of us are gonna push in not has to keep us covered all right where is this damn dreadnought throw a grenade on that On that, please. Oh my God! Stay back there. Oh, 
Only he can get through. We're slowly pushing them back. We'll take that out. Right, we're gonna bring our Dreadnought around towards the left. We're gonna need him in this fight. I can't just not have him over here. No retreat for you guys. Okay. For a second, I thought he was frozen standing up. Oh, dang! Seriously? Down, bring it down. Oh, it's a mech battle. My money's on the dreadnought. Okay, go get you guys back there quickly. <sighs> All right, heal him up. Now we can go. I can't believe I forgot him. Get pushing. Oh, right. No, you stop. You're going to bring up the rear because they do have anti armor. So let's push. All right. Slowly start bringing it up. Bring him down. Take him down. Ooh, that's gonna leave a mark. All right. Even though we have this, I want to go over here and grab these because we could use the resupply. Let's move on. Brothers, fire! Come on, fire! Thank you. All right. Now we have more supply. We got this. All right. Get up here. Now, this should be a little easier since we'll have our Dreadnought to give us some support. Alright, let's do this. Dreadnought, you bring up the rear. Down. You got this. Yes. Nothing but bad news all day. He is just as weak and pathetic as the others. Once you crack his shell. Advance. Repositioning. That wasn't so bad. Now we gotta go finish uh bringing down the rest of the orc encampment. Uh oh. Go we'll take him down. Alright, 
move up. That's gonna hurt. Tactical squad. Seriously, more of you guys? in there. Alright, let's have the tactical squad go heavy guys. Ooh. close now. We got this. Yep, we got this. Move off, and let's get you out of there. Can I literally keep that shield on? And, no, okay, I don't know. I'll say, is it going to regenerate faster than it, you know, am I getting energy back while it's on? That would be cool, because it means the shield can stay on indefinitely. Freaking awesome. Doesn't look like it. Actually, no, we gotta go this way. There's only a little bit left. One more hit, and we got it. Give him one more grenade. All right, get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way. All right, now push up. That's how it's done. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. We're starting to get a lot better at this. Now we get to find out where the final, uh, where the communication array is located. Yeah, that part did suck because we lost two of our guys went down. But, you know, I mean, it's kind of to be expected considering as soon as we came and hit the ground, we were under fire immediately. And there was no stopping it. Uh, we're probably more likely going to be using that. All right, now we can find out where it is. Please be in the same planet. Good work, Commander. We have recovered the stolen data slate and eliminated a major orc threat. Yeah, yeah, we did. Was the recovered data of any use? It was, Cyrus. I have determined the location of the astronomic array and uploaded it onto the planetary map display. In order to recover any data on the hive fleet, you will need to align the array from the ground, Commander. 
Okay. So it's going to be right here. Remains of the Age. Or, remains of the Dark Age. Ooh. Oh, and that optional mission is gone. Really? That sucks. So it looks like when we come back for the next episode, we're going to be going here. So that's going to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know it was a little short, but hey, that was an awesome fight. You know, we're having a big old mech battle one-on-one -on -one just between the Dreadnought and the Killican. That was pretty cool. Uh, I can't wait to see what's going to happen in the next episode. So until then, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode as much as I did playing it. If you guys did, remember to hit the like button down below. Show your support. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment. Let me know you enjoyed it. If you have any comments, suggestions, or feedback, also let me know. Um... But yeah, if you guys want to follow the channel, keep up to date what is going on when I'm posting things. After you subscribe, you get the bell notification icon. That way you guys can keep up to date when I'm posting videos. Also, you can follow me over on Twitter as well as my Discord. Links for those will be in the description down below. I keep everybody up to date what is going on with the channel over there. Um, also, over on my Discord, you guys can talk with me, hang out with me, and other YouTubers and other gamers. It's loads of fun. Hopefully, I get to see you guys over there. Uh, we are doing some gaming days, uh, playing all sorts of games. Um, so, hopefully, I get to see you guys over there. Also, I would like to take a moment to say thank you so much to my Patreon supporters. Thank you guys so much for going the extra mile to help support the channel during these uncertain times it really means a lot to me every dollar does help so if you guys also want to go the extra mile and help support the channel there will be a link in the description down below as well at the end of the video for my patreons so hopefully uh yeah till next time th thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next episode take care guys and remember have an awesome day